Okay. So hit the button. I hit the button. Okay. All right. So I'm doing the filming today. Steve, what are we doing today? What are, what are, what are we gonna do today? Uh, we were looking at some coneflowers. That's right. Okay. I know where those are. Okay. Let's see if you know where those are. Okay. Echinacea. No coneflowers. No, that's the same thing. I like coneflower better. <laughs> Cause that's what I knew. <laughs> Here are the cone flowers. Those. Here are cone Whoa, flowers. Whoa, you did so fast. You got a pan. You know they'll get seasick or they'll get motion sickness. Oh, all right. Slowly yeah. we turn step by step. That's not a cone flower. No, no. Step by step. And there's the cone um, flowers. Is she supposed to get in the water? I get. Jersey, 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 no, 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 Jersey, are you gonna be stinky? Oh, we are collars on. Today we're gonna to be talking about cone flowers. Cone flowers. And they are perfect. Like they are the ultimate plant if you're planting a butterfly garden. Oh the dog is. You can't take her anywhere. What are you doing? What are you doing? Does that feel good? <laughs> Are you happy days, Mama? Happy days. Oh, wet, happy days. Smelly puppy. What'd you do? She's not talking to us. Okay, so these are coneflowers. Now you're seeing these kind of towards the heat of the summer, so they're a little jagged and ragged, and we have a some type of beetle infestation. So see. There's one right there. Look at that. I think he got away. He got, oh, oh, no, there, there it is. is. See that little guy? That guy eats. And I just kill him because we don't, we don't like to use insecticide oh, here. Oh, nasty. So, anyway. <sighs> Are you saying already? There's a bee. No, no, well, we're here. Yeah. Come on. Okay. So anyway, <laughs> don't trip over the dog. Coneflowers, if you're going to start a butterfly garden, this is a perfect, listen to those wrens screaming at us. Uh, Look at us. We're like two adults, like ADD. I know. All right. Keep getting, uh, where, where, you know where we were? No, you didn't get past the bugs. <laughs> if you're going to start a butterfly garden, this is one of the first plants you have to consider. It is a great nectar source. And whoa, it's not me. the oh, great okay. nectar source, and it's native, and it's easy to grow because it's a native, and it already lives here. So it comes and back, they're pretty. and they're nice looking. This is the native. This is uh, Echinacea purpurea. I think that's Echinacea how you put, purpurea. I think that's how you say it. This is a purple coneflower. There's lots of new varieties, yellow, uh, there's oranges and reds and everything in between, whites, but we like the native. And look, this is what, like, feel that. Why honey. do we like the native? It's easy to grow, and it, it's the native, it's the original, feel that. Ah. I thought it was gonna be soft and squishy, but it's not, <laughs> it's, it's, it's like that tree that I made you grab. Oh, that hurt, <laughs> that was like needles. <laughs> Yeah, my husband thought it'd be funny to say to me one day we were away and there was this like kind of something fluffy looking like this but it on wasn't. a tree and he's like, Kelly, grab it. And these, this was like back oh, when we were gr first married and I actually trusted him because those days are long over and I actually grabbed it and it was like needles I going think into it was my be, fingers. It wasn't supposed to be I that sharp. I think he drew blood. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to be that sharp. Oh, anyway, games now, uh, are we filming the purple? Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. uh, they, they've seen this for the okay. last five minutes. So anyway, uh, this should be in everybody's butterfly garden. If you don't have a butterfly garden and you just want to do an easy perennial garden, this is a great uh, plant to have. 
you can see even under stress out conditions uh, where there's a lot of beetle infestation, this thing is growing like crazy. It'll reseed. Look at how pretty that all looks. It'll reseed, come back year after year. And the other great thing is when it goes to seed, you hear those birds behind me? goldfinches fly down here and eat that bird. You're getting too close. Yeah, to the, he's pissed off at me. He's really upset. Does he have babies in the house? There seems to be a perpetual bunch of babies All right. in that. I'm not going to back up any further. I'm yeah. going to come closer to you. Anyway, uh, the other thing is in the fall, look at that bee. See? I don't know if I... Oh, before, when I was like, look at the bee, you're like, we don't want to look at bees. Oh, oh, I go. missed it. Um, and so, now he wants we're going to have to edit bee. the hell out of this. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Why? Uh, uh, when it's done blooming and it starts to produce seeds, the goldfinches come and eat all the seed. And it'll also, if you let it go to seed, uh, don't deadhead it, uh, it'll produce more plants, which everybody likes. Uh, we get plants here What's in the beds deadhead? that we transfer them elsewhere. This was originally... What's deadheaded? What does that mean? I only know deadhead, like, people Not... who listen to, like, you know, the dead. They're called deadheads. <laughs> What's dead? It's not MTV. Well, that's the only thing I know. When you cut the old bloom off to start a new bloom. Oh, you clip the flower part off? The dead head. Oh. You can deadhead these and you'll get a secondary bloom. Uh, we'll go through here and do a few so we keep them blooming. Uh, the, other, uh, the other thing is whenever you do a butterfly garden, try to plant for the season. What that means is there's early butterflies, there's mid-season butterflies, and there's late butterflies. Coneflower will bloom in late June all the way through fall, and you can extend the blooming season by deadheading them. Now I know what that means. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I think that's about it. Uh, but as you can see, the, the, this Jersey, is... you waiting for a ride? Hey. Where are you going? Are you going out? She's waiting for an Uber again. <laughs> She's waiting for an Uber. Waiting, waiting for an Uber. Waiting for an Uber. The, uh, this was one or two plants originally, and as you can see, there's several hundred clustered here, and there's more over there. Getting slowly. And we're doing this a little late at night after the thunderstorm, so normally there would be butterflies yeah. all over here. It's freaking hot plants. out. And it's <laughs> And you can see there's some over there, too. It's so humid. See them over there? Oh, yeah. There's By the, um, the tiger lilies. The tiger lilies. Yeah. Yeah. And there's some in the backyard, so we have see them everywhere. Them? So anyway, They're everywhere. if you're gardening for wildlife or butterfly gardening, purple cone flower is a must-have plant in the garden. So must have. We ho hope we hope you've enjoyed our babbling and at least saw a purple cone flower. And oh, oh come, come this way. Come this oh my way. God, he keeps on going. That's twice he said he was done. I can hear you. This is my life, people. This I is my life. You. So all the cone flowers over here, three years ago, were seedlings from over there. Just three years ago. Oh my God! You see, I came in three years ago. <laughs> so if you look here, Can't me no, look, look, hey cameraman, look into the garden. Oh, what are we looking at? Cone flowers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> More? <laughs> I was just explaining that the cone flowers you see <laughs> come up here. What, oh my god, I'm losing the camera. The heat. The <laughs> heat. The, 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 she's I think I have heat stroke. Come on, you're getting heat stroke. Uh, Follow the garden well, up I here. I like the pretty yellow. No, those are sweet. I do too. Those are sweet cone flowers. No, they're beautiful. Don't let them. That's next video. Look, they look more yellow in no, the picture. Than that's next thing. video. Hi. I'm just saying. Come on through here. They got a sneak peek. There you go. Come through here. Such a stickler. <laughs> See all these common flowers down here? Again, three years ago, these were seedlings from what you saw in the front. That's where I was. Crazy. There you go. So you, I hope this inspires you to have a, a wildlife garden. There's a gnat flying around <laughs> Kelly's face. So if the video gets a little bumpy. Bumpy ride. Uh, so anyway, purple cone flower, plant it. It's good for the butterflies. It's beautiful.